Hello everyone, Devjit here from iucdo.com and today in this video tutorial, I am going to teach you how to create a course in Tutor LMS. At first, I will teach you how to create the free course and after that, I will teach you how to convert the free course to your premium courses. For creating the course, first of all, you have to come to the dashboard. I already installed all the required plugins like Elementor, WooCommerce, Tutor LMS, Tutor LMS Pro like that. And for your kind information, I already make a dedicated video how to create a LMS website by using tutor lms and for that video just go to the video description there i'll give that link for that video else you can directly come to the youtube and type oebso tips and after that here you can see the video that is the video what i'm talking about and in this video tutorial i explain each and every details of the tutor lms i will give the link of that video in the video description from there you can access the video now let's come back here before creating the course first of all i have to create the course category so for that hover on the tutor lms pro or tutor lms whatever and after that you have to click in the categories next here i have to enter the category name after that i have to click in this add new category let me add another category also again i have to click in this add new category so like that you have to add all the required categories now i have to create the course for that i have to click in the courses next i have to click in this option add new so starting i have to give the name of the course after that i have to enter the description of the course and the description of the course means this one so here i have to mention the description next at the right hand side here you can see the course category you can select the single category else if you want you can select multiple categories also after that here i have to give the tag for the course like business once you write the tag you have to click in the add option next scroll down and here you can see the feature image click in that set feature image suppose i am choosing this image as feature image click in the set feature image after the scroll up little bit so here you can see the maximum number of the student able to enroll the course if you make it zero then unlimited number of the student can enroll the course but if you want that some specific number of the student only can enroll this courses then you can mention the number here suppose i want only 300 student can enroll the course so here i am mentioning 300 after the course difficulty level if you click here here you can see there are total three difficulty levels is available here suppose this course belong to the beginner difficulty level so i am choosing here beginner after that public course no need to select this one because if you select this one then anyone can access this course without enrolling also after that q a obviously enable this question and answer session after that here i have to select this is a free course or paid course first of all i am creating the free course so here i am selecting free option next the most important thing course builder for creating the course first of all i have to create the topic for creating the topic i have to click in this option add new topic so here i have to enter the topic name after that if you want to enter that topic summary always you can add that but it is totally optional after that i have to click in the add topic option so my topic is already added here now i have to add the lessons in this topic so first of all i will teach you how to create a text lesson after that i will teach you how to create a video lesson in the video lesson first of all i will teach you how to host the video directly on the server and later i will teach you how to host the video in youtube and later how to link up that video with your lesson so first of all let me create a text lesson so for that i have to click in this lesson option so here i have to enter the title of the lesson next here i have to write the content of the lesson let me write some dummy content next if you want to upload a featured image for the lesson then easily you can do that for that you have to click in this upload image option and from the media library suppose i am selecting this image click in the use this media scroll down here i does not want to attach any video so i am keeping it as it is after that here you can see the attachment if you want to attach some pdf file or a word file with this lesson then you have to click in this upload attachment next you have to upload that attachment in the media i already upload an attachment like that so after that i have to click in this upload media option next scroll down and you have to click in this update lesson option now let me add a video lesson so for that you have to click in this lesson again suppose i am giving the lesson name as video lesson one if you want to add some text always you can add that it is not necessary that video lesson content only video it may be a combination of text and video also let me add some text here after that from here i have to choose the source of the video if you choose this one html5 then that will be a 
locally hosted video click in this browse file option i have a dummy video just drag and drop the video here so this video already uploaded on the server after that i have to click in the upload media scroll down if you want to attach some attachment then you can click in this and you can attach that document after that i have to click in the update lesson option so in this way you can create a video lesson by using locally hosted video now i will teach you how to host the video in youtube and attach that in your lesson now let me click in this lesson scroll up and here i am giving the lesson name as video lesson 2 now from this drop down i have to select youtube now come to the youtube you have to click in this option create option and after that i have to click in this upload video option suppose that is my video what i am going to upload in the youtube so drag and drop it here like that after that i have to enter the title of the video here i am giving the title as demo 5 scroll down and you have to select this option no it's not made for the kid after that i have to click in the next option again i have to click in the next wait for some time process should be 100% so now it's checking so now checking is completed click in the next and here you have to select unlisted now i have to click in the save option once done you can get the video link here by mistake if you close that then for getting the video link you have to click in the content and after that you have to click on the video here you can get the link so click the copy video link next i have to come here and here i have to paste that link scroll down and click in the update lesson so in this way you can host your video on youtube and you can attach that video in your lesson so i already add almost three lesson here let me create another new topic for creating the topic again i have to click in this add new topic after that i have to enter that topic title here next i have to click in the add topic option now let me add a text lesson here again i have to click in this lesson option again scroll up and here i have to enter the lesson title let me add a text lesson so here i am adding some dummy text scroll down and click in the update lesson option now let me teach you how to attach a quiz in the topic so for that i have to click in this quiz option here i have to write the quiz name i am giving the quiz title as quiz 1 after that if you want to give some summary text always you can give that here let me add some dummy summary text and after that i have to click in the save and next next i have to click in the add question after that here i have to enter the question once you add the question here after that you have to select question type suppose that is a single choice question so i am selecting single choice next answer required yes after that how many point you want to give who give the answer correct suppose 10 points if you want to display the point you can enable that it's up to you after that if you want to give some description then you can wrote the description here and after that i have to click in the add an option so that is a single choice question mean there will be several option and in between those options only one option will be correct remaining will be false let me add the first option here scroll down and click in the update answer in similar manner let me add some more option now in between those options asia is the correct one i have to select asia for the correct option next i have to click in this option add to questions now for adding another question again i have to click in this add questions here i have to enter the question next question type answer required i am giving the 10 points let me add some option and here you can choose your answer type it may be a text answer may be a image answer or may be a text and image combined answer and if you want to upload any image in the answer always you can do that by clicking in this upload image option let me click in the update answer let me add another option click in the update answer again so now in between these two option egypt is the right answer after that i have to click in the add to questions so in this way you can add so many questions and answers next once you upload all the question after that i have to click in the save and next here i have to give the quiz time limit suppose i am giving 2 minute 
and quiz feedback mode make it default attempt allowed suppose i am making it 4 passing grade suppose i am making it 70% scroll down click in the save and next so in this way you can attach a quiz in a topic after that i have to add the additional data as you can see here what will i learn that mean actually if you come to the demo course so here you can see what i will learn so these are the topics you have to enter all the option in a single line suppose that is option and that is another option so i have to enter this option in the next line come to the next line and here i have to write that so like that one by one you have to add all the options after that targeted audience so if you come to the demo website so here you can see some targeted audience point is available here let me copy it here and here i am writing here also each option i have to write in a single line after that total course duration suppose that is one hour 30 minutes next material include if you come to the demo course so here you can see the material include here also i have to add all the point in individual line i mean in each line there will be only one option now requirements if you come to the demo website here you can see the requirements here also you have to mention all the option in a new lines after that if you want to upload any feature video for the course always you can do that it quite similar like attaching the video in lesson if you want to directly host the video in your server then you can choose this html5 option and upload the video else you can select the youtube also suppose i am attaching this video so here i am giving this link here now from the certificate template by default none will be get selected if you want to attach a certificate in your course then who put on the template what you want to attach with this course and after that i have to click in the use this option i will teach you how to create the template and i will give the link of that video in the video description so from there you can access that so once done just scroll up and you have to click in the publish option so in this way anyone can create a free course let me check the preview once so as you can see here my course is coming like that it's really looking awesome now i will teach you how to convert a free course to a paid course or a premium course in tutorial ms when you convert a free course to a paid course you must and have to install woocommerce plugin i already do that so now just copy the title of the course hover on the products and first of all i have to click in the categories because here also i have to create the categories so these are the categories like language so here i have to write the category name scroll down and click in the add new category and another category will be health and fitness similarly here i have to write the category name and i have to click in the add new category now i have to create a product so for that i have to click in the add new option now always try to give the product name similar to the course name it will be easy to find out now i have to select the category what you select in the course try to always select the same category here after that i have to check this option for tutor next you have to enter the course rate suppose 9000 if you want to give some discount rate always you can do that suppose 8500 after that you have to click in the publish option now once you publish this one again i have to come back to the tutor lms now again i have to open that course till now this course is a free course now i am converting this course to a paid course so for that here i have to choose paid and from the select product option i have to select the product what i just created now scroll up and click in the update option now this is not a free course now it's become a paid course let me check the preview so as you can see here now this is not a free course it's become a paid course so in this way anyone can create free course or paid course in tutor lms i'm ending this video tutorial here if you have any kind of doubt you can ask me in the comment section thank you have a nice day